Hello and welcome to Super Nintendo Classics. In this installment, the game is Run Saber, released in 1993, developed by uh, Atlas and published by, um, I believe it was Hori Electric, which is rather unusual, but okay. Uh, this is a Strider clone for the Super Nintendo, and it's actually a really good game. Uh, this game is has recently shot up in price uh, quite a bit, so if you own a copy, you know, don't sell it. And if you're looking for a copy, well, you're probably going to have to spend a bit of money for this game. There are two different play playable characters. There's a guy and there's a girl. Um, they pretty much just are the same character, just di with a different sprite. So, you know, it doesn't really matter which sprite you go with. So I'm going to go with the girl. Now, get into the gameplay. The gameplay is all about just you know, pressing the Y button to attack, you pressing the B button to jump, and you can do some crazy moves such as like the spinning move, there's also a magic attack that you can do with the A button. And much like Strider, um, the gameplay comes in uh, be, be very interesting because there's uh, a whole variety of different moves that you can perform, and you know, you can scale walls. fall down, you can even uh, swing along ceilings, you can go anywhere you want. Well, it's going to go down, so I will. I died. But when you die, you respawn right where you uh, left off, so minimal, minimal frustration in this game. Alright, beat the boss, and just continue right on. Well, the boss here is certainly one that's memorable. Well...
Uh oh. Fell off. So let's continue. Hooray for the amazing Mode 7. So I'll show you guys the second stage. Run Saber is just one of those games, that, you know, that uh, is not very commonly well known, but it's an awesome game. This is, you know, one of those definite hidden gems on the Super Nintendo. By here. We just have to wait until invincibility. Okay, that does a magic attack. That doesn't help. <laughs> okay, I guess maybe just have to walk by. The stages are short but challenging. That is, uh, you know, definitely one thing I've disabled the game. Dang it. Dang it, I did the thing maybe twice. so easily. Right, might as well use my magic attack. <laughs> and then die.
dip. You know. Dang it! Wasn't expecting that. Well, anyway, there's a look at Run Saber for the Super Nintendo. It's a challenging game. Um, you know, I'm playing it on normal here. I could have uh, bumped it down to easier and showed you a bit more gameplay. But, you know, it's one of those games where it's a whole lot of fun to play. The levels are really short, so you can master the game if you play the game enough. Um, but the game is fantastic. It's called Run Saber. Uh, it's a rare game, so you're going to be spending a bit of money if you want a copy in these days. Um, like I said, if you have any questions, feel free to leave those in the comment section down below. Also, be sure to hit the like button, because hitting the like button helps support my channel and lets me know that you guys want to see more videos like this. So, like I said, thanks for watching.